is going on guys we are back with another uh, well oh i almost said legend we're back with another dokkan battle video and i actually really like this frieza he's really good and also i actually like this card that that's one of the main reasons why i actually rainbow him and by the way just a quick disclaimer if you guys do hear a little bit of a slur or a little bit of a lift it's because i have my retainers on you know we're trying to keep them teeth nice and clean and nice and straight you know but uh that's besides the point man we're gonna be going over this uh frieza and sword bay <clears throat> who's actually supposed to get it well not supposed to it wasn't really confirmed but due to his stats and his leader skills he's supposed to, he should be getting an eva right pretty soon but he's actually really really good without one this passive is painstaking preparations which is attack and defense plus 120% when HP is 50% or more. Key plus 6 performs a critical hit and stun the attack enemy within the same turn after receiving an attack. That is really, really good. And then he acts like uh, the other Golden Freezers where he reduces damage if he is within a certain HP threshold, right? Uh, his links obviously is this. I didn't, um, I didn't get to grinding them because the unit literally just came out. I got to grinding as soon as it dropped. And uh, yeah, we're going to be taking a look at him on Terrifying Conquerors because he is not on Wicked Bloodline because of this little, little team right here, this little guy. So uh, yeah, I got uh, this team right here. It's mostly to support the Fiza to get him his highest damage output. And without further ado, let's hop into a Dokkan event. Alright guys, we are here in the new Angel Golden Freezer Dokkan event. And uh, what better way, you know, to show off the new uh, Golden Frieza free to play on the new Golden Frieza Dokkan event. Now, we're gonna pair him up with the uh, two support units. I'm pretty sure he'll be at his best with any two support units here because we do have a couple. We do have the uh, Darkness Toa. We do have the, uh, or the Goddess Toa, whatever her name is. We do have the actual two leaders, the two Final Form Coolers. They do act as support units before he does transform. And then we have the metal cooler also, so it's actually going to be a pretty good time for this Frieza. He it will be backed up with a lot of support, and we will get his best attack like once cooler reaches that rotation. Jeez, you see that? Like that was because of the two coolers. All right, now let's see what this Frieza play uh, Frieza got. He is only getting supported by one unit, which is this Toa right here. So let's see what he does here. He does also stun the enemy and uh, crits, but you know. 900 okay and it looks hd this looks hd okay 800k not a lot but it's all good i think he could uh break a million with uh cooler on the other uh, uh other slot basically in between yeah yeah she is she is such a dirty support type unit she's a dirty dirty girl bro but she doesn't really hit a lot but then again she is a support unit so she's not supposed to be hitting hard but she's very very good all right we got yo when this guy gets an eta bro he is going to be dumb he is going to be dumb he's gonna hit so hard like it's crazy all right that's uh let, let's see how much cool it does he's gonna eviscerate this visa right here he is going to absolutely eviscerate this visa let's see we are only going to go through the Dokkan event. I just wanted to see what this Frieza could do because, you know, like I said, I really only rainbowed him so he could be my box with his uh, current card art because I do love, I love that card art. I don't know. It just stands out to me. So this will be his best rotation. So hopefully cool doesn't kill. Uh, like, a, you know, he could have just you known crit twice. So hopefully he doesn't do that. Two mil, bro. This guy, he, he's so dumb. He's going to age so well. And he only transforms only after three turns and he guaranteed like this crit i mean this guy cooler bro he, he's just stupid all right let's see oh he didn't break a million i don't think toa maybe maybe he, he'll be better with a uh, metal cooler because toa actually only gives one support type unit i mean one support and then the rest are chances i think uh, but it's a one time speed but the rest are chances and then once I hit below 50%, which I didn't hit, um, he does, uh, or she does give an extra attack and even plus 50. But until that, I am only getting a little bit. So, let's see if, uh, if he could break a million with Metal Cooler and Final Form Cooler in one rotation. Let's see. And look at this brother-on-brother -brother violence, man. It's crazy. 
man if you, are, are you new here man is that the subscribe button hit i think you should go down there and hit it man jo join the squad man let's get to 200 subs before the end of january we are on that grind and do not forget to hit that subscribe button i mean that like button before you come back to finish watching the rest of the video man uh, i do want to do more dokkan content i will start doing the sbr stages that did come out on christmas so uh make sure you guys do stay tuned for that and if actually if you guys like want a lot more dokkan content just let me know by hitting that like button or just let me know in the comments i want more dokkan content i want to see you play more dokkan because i i really like dokkan too i mean yeah everyone says it's just popping bubbles but i mean you see me playing the game so it doesn't mean i don't like it if i'm playing the game who, who plays the game they don't like and anyway so enough of that rambling and i've been playing oh he didn't break it that that's I guess that's as high as the tax that I don't think he could go any Oh wait no Cooler's Cooler's passive isn't active actually. I have to be facing two enemies. I just I just I literally read his passive before I um I started the video. That's crazy. So would he have done better? No, he could break a million then. This uh Frieza could break a million. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut into another Dokkan event and see him uh we're gonna have uh two enemies we're gonna try to fight two enemies and then we'll have a uh, uh cooler and uh another support type unit there because cooler's passive is not uh, active that's why he's like i'm like bro i know that this guy could break a million anyways i'll see you guys in the next Dokkan event all right guys we are here in the beers Dokkan event it actually took me a while to think about what Dokkan event has two enemies and actually, when I thought about this one, I remember that we still have infinite health. And then now that I'm thinking about it, so does the uh, the Masu and the AGL Bose event. But you know, I just thought about that. But yeah, so we're gonna attack Whis here. And then next rotation, we actually have a double cooler support rotation. So we'll see how high Frieza can hit, and that will basically be it for the end of the video. I was thinking about going into a uh, Wicked Bloodline category to the battle stage, but. Nah, it's, it's too long for that. Just to show off a free to play unit who I only like grinded so instantly because of his card art. I don't think so. I just want to see how good he does and you know post it on YouTube basically. Plus, I am probably one of the uh, first global players to uh, upload how good this Risa is, right? Like, I am probably one of the fastest people to rainbow him because everyone else probably just went straight to the golden freezer banner and summoned away while. I had went instantly to the story event and started grinding this guy. I mean, unless you're really, really desperate for stones. But, yep, there we go. Yep, 1.2 million. I'm pretty sure. Right, and he dodged it. Oh, yeah. At least that is everything. I forgot. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Wait, so, uh, yeah. Okay, Metal Cooler is going to that rotation. So, we'll, uh, we'll do one more. We'll, like, attack, um, we will attack, no, no, we'll keep attacking Whis and then next rotation will attack Beerus with Golden Frieza and Sword Bay. Even though Sword Bay is not on the sprite, that's kind of weird, bro. Like, he's on the super attack, yeah, and they do that with a lot of characters, but it would have been cool if a Sword Bay was actually on the main. I'm pretty sure they, they still have joint forces for that, right? They should, because it is technically two cards. It's just like the Bulma and Vegeta card, where Vegeta... It's the only sprite and there's no Boma. It would have been cool if he was like holding Boma. The sprite would have been uh, Vegeta holding Boma. It, it would have been cool, you know? Alright, but uh, let me just make sure, right? I, I don't know, I just want to know. Yeah, he does have joint forces. I literally went over this card in the beginning of the video, bro. Okay, let's, uh, I, I don't think Cooler will kill Beerus. If he does, that's, I, I, I don't know. I highly doubt it. It's type neutral, this cooler doesn't really hit that hard even though he is being support. Actually, never mind. He's gonna get uh, sealed. <laughs> That's tough. Alright, but actually it gives me uh, a good thing now. It gives me a special rate feeling. Are you? Uh, I, I'm not gonna lie. I think, I think we'll just end it here because uh, he won't be double supported in my rotation, so it doesn't matter. So uh, yeah, we'll end it here, man. Like I said in the beginning of the video, let me know if you guys want to see more Dokkan content, man. Let me know if you guys want to see me go against the FBR stages. Well, I will be doing it because I did ask on Twitter. By the way, follow me on Twitter right on the right side of the screen right there. I did ask if you guys want to see me go against the FBR stages. And majority said yes, so expect a video for that. And uh, just, yeah, 
uh, let me know what you guys think about this Frieza. I really like this card art. That's why I, I uh, rainbowed him. And without further ado, man, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.